monsters, big and small, have to start somewhere. Yes, even dragons come from little eggs. The interior of this termite mound is a dragon's nursery. Lace monitors are not just one of the most delicately patterned of monitor lizards. They're also one of the shrewdest. This female has laid her eggs in the safest possible place. The mound is warm and protected by tiny defenders. And it's just as well because, once laid, she leaves her papery eggs for a full nine months. On the mother's return, the hole that she dug to lay the eggs might well have been repaired by the conscientious termites. To help her brood get out, she sometimes has to break back in. But it's her last bit of parenting. After this, the youngsters are on their own. From now on, it's fend for yourself time. Adult monitors have few predators, but for the youngsters, there's danger around every corner. The last thing you want to meet on your first big day out is a carpet python. Fortunately, even at this tender age, they are adept climbers, a skill that will be well exploited later in life. As adults, swimming is another of their talents. However, climbing trees still remains a favourite pastime, so a vertical ascent to steal a few eggs from an apostle bird is no problem. Neither is the bird's desperate defence. On the monitor's thick skin, its pecks are no more than an irritant. The lace monitor's cousin, a Gould's monitor, is joining the holiday makers and checking out its chances of a meal. It's seen a few campers. Not that the campers themselves are about to be eaten, but a bold lizard with a bit of charisma could certainly charm some chocolate from a soft hearted Australian. There's only one lizard that would rather have the camper than the chocolate. Occupying a small group of islands in the Indonesian archipelago are Komodo dragons. Like huge land crocodiles, these meat-eating monsters can grow to three and a half meters in length. Local deer or buffalo are their favourites, and once begun, a Komodo meal can last for days. The smell of carrion eight kilometres away will attract them from all around the island, and pretty soon, there's a scrum of dragons. 
And talk about halitosis. The saliva of these beasts is teeming with so many bacteria that a single scratch can kill you. Surely they're the ultimate dragon, with undoubtedly the fieriest breath. This is a parenti found in Australia. He's doing a bit of beachcombing on Barrow Island. But what for? We'll tell you after the break.